Hi everyone, welcome back to another video. Today I'll be doing a tutorial on how to build a 1 to 1 scale Airbus A320 in Minecraft. This will be a bit different from the ATL72 tutorial that I did. I'll be doing it in layers like I did the A330 but on a much smaller scale. So hopefully that will make it a bit easier to follow. So yeah, thank you all for 150 subscribers and let's get started. So to start off with just the nose gear, we'll do a coal block and then two stone buttons on either side. You'll also want to place an andesite wall block on top of that. Now for the main fuselage, uh, you can really use any white uh, block that has uh, stairs and slabs. I'm going to use smooth quartz because that's in the version of Minecraft that I'm using, but for some, some versions don't have that. So I'm going to place a slab on either side of the wall and then going to go forward with slabs 1, 2, 3, like that. So I'm going to go back with slabs 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, place an extra block, and then I'm going to go out 1 on both sides, and then back I'm going to go 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, do that on the other side, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, and then fill in the middle, and then you can, back, and then you can go back 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 more. So I'll go 1, 2, 3 in, and then I'll measure out 1, 2, 3 blocks. Then place a slab there, go two more forward, and then one in the middle underneath, like that. Destroy these blocks. In between this part and this part, right in the middle, you'll place another coal block, two stone buttons, and then an andesite wall on top. Go two blocks out with the wall, and then one with the smooth block quartz slab. Break these. Then I want to go in one here, with the smooth stone slabs, go one, two out, forward, and then one down and break this again. So this stairs I'm going to go two along here, two along on the other side, and then slabs on the bottom in this shape here, like that, and then I'm going to use stone bricks to do the engine here, the front of the engine like that, and then just repeat that whole process on the other side. And there you go, that's the first layer of the aircraft done. So for the next layer, I'm going to start off at the nose by placing two blocks there. Then go back one, and out one, break this block. We'll go back one here, and then here is a door. So you can use any other different coloured white block. Uh, since I use smooth quartz here, I just use normal quartz there. The The difference is, it's, it's barely noticeable, but it just, just, just so you can tell where the door actually is, is fine. And then go all the way back so it lines up with this block here. And then go back an extra one, two, three, four blocks. Now you want to place three slabs on top like that. Another three down there like that. Then go along an extra one and up and then two back. Uh, this is going to be... No. <laughs> no. Then you can just repeat that whole thing just that we just did on the other side. And there you go. Moving on to the wing, uh, I'm going to be using smooth stone slabs and stone brick slabs for the uh, wing colours. So I'll be doing the leading edge of the wing first for this layer. I'll do one, one block here. Then go back one, two. And then one, and then we go up one like that. One, two, one, two, and then just one and then a smooth quartz slab on the end here. Then I'll use smooth stone slabs to go down to like that, and then a slab on the back like that. So for the back edge of the wing we're going to go one, two, three like that, go down one just there, then go forward one, and continue along to the edge of the fuselage. We're going to put a smooth quartz slab there like that, then a smooth stone slab and then stone brick slab there and go up and just fill in this area like that all the way along to the fuselage and you can kind of use nether brick slabs like that and then more smooth quartz slabs like that to make it kind of look like the path that the escape slide goes down uh, in an emergency 
Just nice little detail that makes the wing look quite a lot more realistic. Once again, do the exact same thing on the other side. If you have world edit, then you can just select this area, flip it, and then paste it on the other side so you don't have to build the whole thing again. But if you don't, you might just have to repeat everything here. And once you've done that, that should be this layer done. Moving on to the next layer, you'll want to do the cockpit windows by placing three grey stained glass blocks, just like that. And you'll want to go back one on both sides, and then do backwards quartz stairs on the doors. Then you'll want to run upside down stairs like this, all the way up to here, and then you'll do two quartz slabs that are like the door colour to do emergency exits. Actually, I forgot you need to do quartz slabs um, down on this layer as well as this is part of the emergency exit and then you'll want to do more upside down stairs as doors, windows all the way back to here then you'll do a block there and an upward facing stair for the rear exit a block and a slab just like that go up with a slab here two back up one again and then two back like that and then one more along with the slab uh, on this layer repeat this whole layer of the fuselage on the other side And there we are. Who are you? Huh? Moving on to this layer of the wing, you want to go up one, along one, break this one, and then go back two along, like that. Back two more along, like that. And then a st uh, stair on the end, just facing that way. And on the back, place an upside down stair, and then place two blocks, like that. And then just put a stone brick slab, like that. Oh, and one more smooth stone slab there. Again, just repeat that on the other side, just like so. There we go. And that's that layer done. Now for the next layer, go back with a slab there. Put a block there and then put a stair there. And then go with slabs all the way along to the back of the aircraft. like so, then go down one and along two, and this is the very back point of the aircraft, no, nothing will be built further back than this. You can just run slabs like this all the way along, to the front of the aircraft there, and on the other side all the way back. Just like that. So for the horizontal stabilizer, place four blocks in this shape here, and then go up one like that, there, then go back like that and place these blocks in this shape. Just do the same thing on the other side. And there you go. And add another stair and slab like this to finish off these sharklets. Uh, you could not have sharklets and just have the smaller winglets, which are on a lot of A320s, but for some, I quite like the sharklets, uh, how they look, but it's not required for this aircraft. The same on the other side. Just like that. And the final step is going up three here for the tail. Up again, one back. So this is three, two, three. This is three. Then go one forward. One down. And then... Uh, place a slab here so it goes one and a half down, one and a half down again, one along, and then just like this shape here, and go and fill this in, and that should be it. And there it is, uh, that is it for the finished aircraft of the A320. Uh, if you want, you can add a livery. I added an easy jet livery over here. Um, if you want, you can just paint it yourself um, or do a different airline of your choosing. Or you can just leave it white. I hope this was helpful. Uh, thank you so much for watching. Please like and subscribe to my channel. And I'll see you in another video. Bye for